Hello fellow YouTubers and welcome back to Mario and Luigi Superstar Saga. In the last episode, we started our little adventure through the fourth dungeon, which is the Chuckle Huck Woods. Um, learned how to do our new bros attacks. Got revealed pipe number five, which, which will let us go back here whenever we want. And discovered three enemies out of four enemies that we can find in this area. The... What was it? The Pest Nut, the Chuck Guy, and a Gold Beanie. Found a couple Gold Beanies, actually. And on this episode, we're gonna be going up here because this is where we're... This is why we stopped right now. So now we have the quest of trying to find the three different colored Chocola fruits, and he's gonna, if you walk up to him, he's going to explain it once more. I did not actually mean to try and walk up to him and have him explain it. So we're gonna head up right first because I can't bring up the map, but, oh, actually I can. There's only one path this way, but if you look at this room, there's two paths. One will lead us down there, the other one will lead us up there and then into that little cave that we were once in, and it'll bring us right back out to where that giant ledge was at. So if we head right first, there's there's only one thing over here, including enemies. Let's see if we can fight all the enemies first. Where are all these enemies at? There we go. They're all in that middle tree. And Mario should level up from that battle. Let's see. Let's get his stats down. I'd keep track of these, but I don't really care. That's future me's problem. Take that, future me. <laughs> you have to keep track of these stats. Let's get his BP up, since I'm seeing, I seemingly, be, I'm seeming to use the bros moves a lot more often now. So I really should probably level up their bros, their BP, so I can use them a lot more and not have to use syrup to replenish it. There we go. Get that chuckle bean. Take this. Take that. Oh, oh, what was that? Some, I saw something. Oh, that's a Chuck guy up there. Wrong, wrong bro attack. I missed completely. I screwed up the knockback bros in that last one. I completely forgot whether or not it's in a row or if it's just total. I feel like it's in a row. I'm talking about advanced moves, by the way. These enemies are going pretty quick. Let's go up here, because this is a unconnected room. There's just a bunch of boulders in here. And as you see, when I unearth the boulders, I can earth, unearth bean places, or where bean locations are at. I think there's four or five in this room. Well, there's five. No, not five. Did I say five? I meant four. Anyway, what I was going... I just remembered what I was going to talk about last episode. Um, recently, for some reason... I've, I've, I've turned 13 again, and I've been watching Super Mario Bros. Z. If anyone remembers what that is, <laughs> I just started re-watching that for some reason. I guess it's because they use the Mario and Luigi sprites from this game in that show. Oh, but that, that, I mean, for some reason, I just randomly stumbled upon it once again, and I just had to continue watching it. I mean, it's 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 nine it's eight episodes long. If anyone has never heard of it, it's it's like a mix up of Mario the Mario series, uh, Dragon Ball Z series, and I'm not going to spoil the third series, but it, you can pretty much guess what it's going to be from the first episode. Uh, it it like the first couple episodes are more comedy influence, and then it then it hits the action button and it just goes crazy. I mean, it's still comedy influence throughout it throughout, but. It's just amazing what happens in that show. I need to I need to rewatch it again. Anyway, we had a little puzzle right here. So I didn't show this off last uh, when we learned how to separate, but if I actually press the B button right now, or if I press start, I'll switch over to Luigi. So I'll have Luigi walk over here, so that we can actually separate the bros. We just need either Mario to be mini or Luigi to go underground. Have Mario go over here. 
there's a reason why I'm doing the separation. And as you see right over here, I have a I have a bean thing to go get. In fact, in fact, I need Mario to come back over here. Cause I can't. I have to get over there as Luigi, and then have Mario go in that. All right. Let's get you back up. Hit that. Give me the chuckle bean. For some reason, Mario does not like to hit if I don't approve it. So I need to hit this thing. And it's only going to open up that gate. Oh, crap. I forgot that this is timed. Nope, it's timed. Get back over here. So we have to, so as you see, I'm timed right now. We have to hurry up before that gate closes. Luckily, there we go. And I got the white Chocola fruit. I actually thought I was going to get red. Or... So that button right there would have stopped the timer. Luckily, since all I had to do was grab the fruit, the timer stopped anyway. What's another web series that I need to start rewatching again? <laughs> There's not a lot of web series that I watched when I was a teenager that's either still going on now or have stopped, and I really want to watch it because it's been such a long time. None really come to mind. I just wanted to look at the map. We have two more directions to go in. A lot of enemies in here. Oh, he even got me up here. Oh, let's get Mario to hit that. New nut for refreshing her. I'm losing the ability to speak again. It seems like there's a one episode every single series that I just lose the ability to speak English. See, I keep on finding a lot of these golden beanies. I'm completely out of BP, by the way. Okay, there we go. Back on track. Mario now levels up first. Unless they are both going to level up here. Then I guess Mario levels up first anyway. Let's see. Let's get his. Let's get his stash up. No, stash. Just because. I haven't leveled this up in a while, so there's a bunch of high numbers over here. Finally, Luigi levels up after Mario. Not like it's a big thing. It just... It just... It's just a little annoying if you're used to seeing Mario level up first. Let's have Luigi get some BP. This is almost exclusively fours, and oh, of course it's a two. There are a lot of fours, and I get a two. There should be a couple more enemies up here, I think. Yes, yeah, just one more. <laughs> and it hits Luigi in the back. Well, that was quick. I only did one attack each. Anyway, as you see right here, there's two different paths. We're gonna take this one because we have to backtrack for a bit anyway. So this is where you would have learned wh where, <laughs> what these things are. And these ones look different. These are the only way. These are the only place where they look like this, and they only make this noise here. And then the fifth one right here. I can't believe I missed it. There we go. Now let's go back and talk to the little the little tree. weird place for a room. She doesn't have anything in there. I guess she's a tree, so it doesn't really matter. But there's the red one right there. Now, if you look right here... There, there seemed to be something in the way. There's, there should be... It looks like there's nothing down here. I mean, there's nothing really down here. Maybe if I do this... Mario display any sign of emotion does not look like it. I can't leave this without without there we go. So I don't know why that's there. Is there No there isn't. Okay. Well let's have Mario be many now. Go through this thing. Wow. 
So, looks like we we made this Wiggler angry. Let's jump on him. <laughs> and here is another boss, Wiggler. And by boss, I mean that with the lowest common denominator of boss. This one is incredibly easy, like less than Tollstar stats right now. This should be very quick. Oh wait, I completely forgot. I have to make him unangry first. So in order to make him unangry, you need to jump on his body parts back here, and you need to turn him to softy mode. Oh, I forgot to dodge. So that, that, that first attack I did on his face was completely pointless. No, Luigi! So now Luigi's actually KO'd. However, I do not want him to be KO'd, so I'm going to give him... I don't really want to give him a super. No, let's give him that. Oh, they even gave him more BP. Now Luigi's back to normal. With increased BP. I, I, Luigi, you gotta jump. <laughs> I'm pressing the button at the wrong point, and I'm blaming Luigi for it. Once all four body parts of his are safe... No! No! <laughs> thank God I cannot run. Attack's face now. Set his face. And one hit! That's what it takes. And unlike other bosses, uh, my stats don't get healed. So, he's more like a mini boss, but the boss theme plays anyway. And let's get this red Chocola fruit. We need Luigi to grab one of these, just because I like equality. And Mario's grabbed so far two out of the three. And that basically makes it impossible for Luigi to grab the same amount. Anyway, we're gonna we're gonna trample through the girls' room again. Now we're gonna go through this way. Nope, jump on head. Jump on head. And here, after after this enemy. Here is a new enemy. These are called Fuzzbush. <laughs> I don't remember how they attack, but they they basically just look like a, a living tree. And we might not, we might not actually now. Let's actually see what what, it, what one looks like when it attacks. There we go. We're gonna spit out. Oh crap! So they're gonna spit out fuzzies. And as you, if you saw what happened to Mario, he's now a different color than normal. He's actually poisoned right now. And what happened was, at the end of his turn, he lost four health. So I really cannot afford to get him hit again and then take another... And then get hurt again for poison. So let's just kill this guy right now. And Mario should heal himself right now. Thank God I got a refreshing herb because that's exactly what you should use if someone gets poisoned. Surprisingly, the fuzz bushes are very easy to kill. There's something up there. I didn't actually think we could high jump that high. Spin over here. There is a box. Luigi's name on it. Syrup, that's nice. What does the sign say? Purple Chocola Cave. So this is where we find the purple Chocola fruit. We're gonna have Luigi up front because I want him to grab it. Get this. There we go. And this. Yes. We got another bicycle thing up there that we're gonna have to, that we're gonna have to do apparently. No enemies by the looks of things. Let's check over here for boxes. Good call. There is something up here though. Looks like another box. I wonder what's in this what this box. Coins. Well, I guess the more coins the better. You haven't seen any boxes that actually give out items. I wonder if there's any boxes that actually do give out items. You haven't seen one of these since Stardust Fields. I already forgot how to do it. There we go. This is a very long track right here. Why do these even exist? How, how do other people activate these things? Do they have to get a friend to do it? So right there, we're going to have to spin, spin jump across that. So let's just get these things first. We don't technically want to fall. There we go. And Luigi should be up in front for this one. Go ahead and grab it. There we go! We now got all of the fruits. So let's head back. 
And I hope I think every enemy should be dead by now. Yes. So let's head back. I don't have to do this over, do I? No, I don't. So te now we've technically cleared the dungeon. Because we've brought all the fruits back, and like we're doing right now. Oh, you, you better get back here. So we can now go back here. <laughs> box is right here. That one just gave me multiple coins. There should be another box somewhere, right there. Gimme, gimme. There we go. There we go. Got those ones. And now, up here... Let's see if there's anything... Nope. Right here is a save block. We're going to save it right now. Oh, look, Mario was only level 12 when we saved it last time. There we go. So on the next episode of Mario and Luigi Superstar Saga, we're going to be heading up north to the area that we've been trying to get to and see if they have any Chocola Reserve there and try and get it before Popple and Rookie take it. So until next time, hopefully you enjoy.